Only 10 News has this new video, shows a wild police chase. Look how fast these cars are going, trying to catch the driver who was going nearly 100 miles an hour across a couple of local freeways. 10 News reporter Jared Aaron is live in Mountain View now because, Jared, that's where the driver hit a dead end, and there are people sleeping just feet away. Yeah, it could have been so much destruction at the end of that chase when you think about how fast that driver was going. And then he came screeching to a halt in this area. This is Mayberry and 45th. And look at all of these cars lining the street, these homes just right up against the sidewalk, and a chase that ended at a dead end at the end of this cul de sac. Luckily, the driver didn't hit any of this. He must have known he'd been caught because he gave up right when he came to the end. Quite a commotion in this neighborhood at around. 3 a.m. Our 10 News breaking news tracker got this footage of the driver surrendering to cops, his hands in the air, their guns drawn and ready. They initially tried to pull him over, though, for running a red light back near the 94 and Euclid. That's when he sped off. This morning, police are now checking to see if the car he was in was stolen. They arrested the driver, but we've learned there was another person in that car with him, a passenger who ran away from the car when the driver stopped. Police are still looking for that guy. All they've been able to tell us so far is that he was wearing with possibly a San Diego Padres logo on the front. Live in Mountain View, Jared Aarons, 10 News.